Where do you see the future of D365 going, I guess? Uh, that's maybe something that we didn't, or you didn't mention um, in the video on YouTube is where do you see their future going? And are there any um, upcoming like features or trends that uh, companies should be aware of for D365? Yeah, that's a good question. Uh, you know, I think certainly AI and Copilot, you know, the way they're they're building in Copilot into D365 and some of the other Microsoft products, I think that's going to be real powerful and that that's already happening, but I just think that's going to accelerate, you know, the adoption and use of Copilot is going to accelerate. And I also think that uh, Microsoft has a, a pretty unique opportunity here to really go after these monolithic ERP systems like SAP and Oracle, for example, which are their, you know, two of their main competitors. They have an opportunity here to go after them with a more flexible product that can scale, you know, in many ways it can scale as much as an SAP or an Oracle, but it gives you the flexibility that Microsoft affords with this product suite. So you also have the Power, the Power BI, Power Apps, uh, you know, SharePoint, Microsoft Project, Copilot. You have all these other tools at your disposal that give you a lot of flexibility and a lot of power. So I think it's a good way for Microsoft to sort of give customers the best of both worlds. And I think they're gonna to continue to do that.